There are major development plans for Willoughby Bay to empower Antiguans. The Economic Recovery Committee, according to Davin Joseph, who's part of the team, says different projects will take place on the over 3,000 acres of land. From the residential aspect, and residential don't necessarily mean you're building a home to live there, but you could involve yourself in investment properties for the Airbnb market or for the the tourism market. A marina is among the undertakings set to take place. A small light industry park. It will also have agro businesses and it will also have a number of common areas. Joseph says the project could wind up contributing from 5 to 10 percent of the country's gross domestic product. There's also a plan to create a railway for what is being called a heritage train. Our studies have shown that if we're able to put in that uh, railway system there, it can attract upwards of around uh, 200 to 500,000 persons per year and bringing in uh, much needed revenue and employment to the country. The venture will also affect surrounding areas. We'll be reducing the expanse of Potworks Dam while maintaining the volume of water that can be held there. Joseph says the project is in its preliminary stage and there will be consultations with stakeholders. The cost of the development and timeline for completion couldn't be given at this early stage. He says there are plans though to pitch Willoughby Bay and other projects to potential investors. So on the 26th of November, we'll be having an online investment forum to showcase this project, the port project, and the entrepreneurial development program that we're having. Joseph says more information on the forum will be forthcoming. Jessica Russell, ABS News.